Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing well. Um, it's a little bit different of a video today. We got three upgrades we're doing to the Tacoma um, to kind of you know help out with functionality, especially uh, going overland and going camping. Um, more upgrades actually coming tomorrow. This week is lots being done, um, but I kind of want to start here. You know, one of the the first one really is a uh, oversized cup holder and uh, reason being I pretty much exclusively carry like a hydro flask um, or an algae bottle when I'm camping um, going or really driving just in general um, you know as I drink more water and stuff and with the stock uh, as you can see with the stock ones they're they're really small and uh, the bottom of it just doesn't fit in there so with the one I got It will actually sit down in, and then it does use the same like metal adapter piece um, when you're setting that up. So that's gonna be kind of the, the first thing here that I'm gonna knock out. Um, next being some new turn signals um, on these side mirrors. Um, they're all wrapped up there, but they are sequential. So um, got those, and the reason being is actually came out in a parking lot the other day and uh we kind of got a hole so um need to replace those these are actually cheaper and i think a lot better looking from pictures than the oem ones so we'll get those replaced and lastly is going to be um the bullet point mounting solutions they do make these for many different vehicles but i've got it and i'm going to get that set up on the dash with a magsafe mount for my phone and today actually coming in the mail, I've got a mount coming because I don't have Apple CarPlay, especially. Um, I need something a little better for kind of uh, navigation. So I picked up a cheap Walmart uh, tablet that does have GPS and I've got a mount coming where it can mount up by the dash. So yeah, so a couple different things happening. Um, not sure if in that clip you saw in the back, but uh, we do have some stuff going on tomorrow as well. I'll make a video there. But, uh, and lastly, I'll kind of throw in a fourth kind of bonus thing, and it's a, uh, something you can really use, and I actually really encourage you to have at least something similar, um, especially this time of year as we get cold, but in your vehicle, um, no matter what you have, and even if you are in overlanding or not, um, grab one for, you know, significant other's vehicle or anything like that, so makes a great holiday gift guide. So I'm gonna get this stuff installed. Um, I'll try to film as much as I can installing maybe any hiccups I run into, but uh, let's get started. All right, guys, so here we got the uh, center dash all torn apart, um, but this will be the new one. Um, this is the old one. It is absolutely disgusting and gross. Not cleaned it out in a second. Um, wasn't too hard to get this off. Uh, there's, you know, six bolts holding, holding it in, so this one's just gonna go right back down in there. Um, this is a great um, time to be using the uh, the Skeletal. Um, I'll do a video on this kind of coming up, but uh, absolutely love this little tool. Um, it's my kind of pocket go-to pocket knife now, um, but it does have uh, some bits on it, so I should try to open it here one-handed. As you can see, use a screwdriver, so didn't have to go to garage and grab a screwdriver. Um, just have one on me at all times, pretty much, and these heads are removable. But like I said, so that's not, uh, it's not what the video is about. So uh, let's get this all put back together. All right, so moment of truth. Let's uh, see if it fits. And we're solid. Simple. Uh, simple little upgrade, but uh, Definitely nice if you know what you're drinking out of nine times out of ten is a Nalgene bottle or like a hydro flask or Yeti. So, all right, on to it wasn't too hard actually. Um, really just making sure you get everything snapped into place um, and take your time. It's cold out, so all that plastic brittle. So, trying to be a little careful with it. But, uh, all right, on to uh, let's do the side mirrors now. All right, so I uh, got one side up, and uh, as you can see, there's the old side. side all right so uh 
got the bullet point um, system all like set up here. Um, still waiting in on my uh, part to come in to hold the tablet. Um, so I'll definitely make sure to take a video and add that in. But uh, didn't really capture much like of the install process. It's pretty straightforward. They have a lot of like awesome tutorial videos on their website pretty much for whatever unit you're buying. Um, and it's also really nice that they provide every tool that you need even down to like the drill bit. Um, they don't just, you know, reference like, hey, you'll need this drill bit. Like everything is included in the kit. And as you can see here, so I got the system set up. I do have the MagSafe one on here now for my phone. Um, I am recording off my phone, so I can't show you what that looks like. But everything is kind of like the ball set up here. So you just unloosen these and um, you can kind of pivot around where you need. So like I said, I'll put the uh, the tablet one, it's a little longer. I'll put it like over in here somewhere and have it kind of coming out. I still want to be able to see my screen um, if need be. But uh, but yeah, that's, like I said, that's the kit. So it, it comes with everything, which is, like I said, that's awesome. Um, can't wait to uh, to kind of get that up. So, and even this like uh, cool little tool here to, uh, to tighten this stuff even more if need be. Um, and somewhere in here that actually came with like a uh, little bullet uh, bottle opener so uh, i thought that was pretty cool um but yeah so we've added that um and i'll do like once the ipad comes in the cup holder now that i can uh, fit my my uh hydro flask um you know now gene bottles yeti anything like that they can finally fit down in there and again, the turn signals out on the light. So, uh, so yeah, so we got everything kind of added in and uh, let me uh, skip ahead and I'll show you here now when we get the iPad dock mounted up. All right guys, so uh, it's gotten darker here, but my other piece of my tablet, um, like mounting solutions grid just came. So I wanted to show that off. And uh, so yeah, so here we go. Here we go. You got uh, got the MagSafe mount. This will be for my phone. Um, and then over here, um, just kind of on an arm there, I can put a tablet up here. Um, this is actually just a cheap Android tablet. Um, that It does have GPS, so I can run um, using things like Onyx and all that and don't need to connect my phone or anything like that, which I think is awesome. Um, and obviously, you know, this can kind of pivot. I can, you know, get it where I'm comfortable at driving. I can loosen some stuff up. Um, but yeah, so as a whole, you know, between this system, um, the larger cup holder thing, so I can fit hydro flasks, Nalgene bottles, things like that. And, uh, the lights on the outside here, I'm definitely pumped. Um, I think they're three awesome upgrades and now, um, really for my fourth, like kind of bonus thing, um, just because I see a lot of them on sale and I think this is a good reminder time of year but uh you should be having some kind of blanket in your car and uh in these warmer or winter months um you know get something that will keep you warm in case something happens in emergency hopefully it doesn't happen but you just never know and uh i'm a big fan of like a wool blanket or mostly wool obviously like in this case this one is 80 percent wool um and then you know some polyester and uh nylon um from the woolly mammoth brand and uh so far just uh i recently got this so um but i've been impressed and obviously you know wool is gonna have a smell to it at first um definitely you know be ready for that um kind of smells like an old bookstore but uh wool blankets are awesome um they they do a great job of keeping you warm and uh and whatnot so definitely recommend getting something like that for you know if it's not for you even maybe a loved one that doesn't have one in the car so i remember or i know i have to get on to my wife and make sure she's kind of got a winner uh, prep pack in in her vehicle these these you know over the next coming months especially so uh yeah between between the three things i upgraded very easy upgrades you can anybody can do them if i can do it you can do it um so if you have a tacoma or even as far as the uh grid system here if you are um like i said if you get on their website uh, bullet solutions is the company um got a little little tag there or bullet point um mailing solutions um we got my stuff super quick and like i said you can get that on amazon i'll put links in the description below for everything that i got here but uh yeah super easy upgrades and uh they've 
so far, I think they've made a, a pretty big difference. And like I said, none of them are really that expensive. So thanks for checking out the video. Um, again, there'll be or links in the description below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, be on the lookout for future comment or future videos. Uh, we just hit 100 subscribers, and at time of recording, I think I'm at 125. So on the way to 200, that's the next goal. Thanks again, and uh, with this video, should be uploaded before Thanksgiving, right before Thanksgiving. It's week of as recording. Um, happy Thanksgiving, and just want to say so thankful for everybody that's already, you know, watch the videos, subscribed, and uh, and whatnot. So thanks again.